Excuse me, I lost my handbag this morning. Where did you lose it? On the bus. I left it on the number twenty-eight. Well, you're lucky. The conductor found it. Thank goodness. I was worried. Here it is. He gave it to me an hour ago. What did you do last weekend? I went to Oxford. Really? How did you go? I went by car. How long did it take? It took about two hours. Hello, John. I thought you were in Brighton. I was. I drove there on Friday. Yes. And I came back on Saturday morning. Oh. Well, why did you come back? Well, I went to a casino and spent all my money. How did you do that? Well, I won a little at first, then I lost everything. Have a cigarette. No thanks. I'm trying to stop. Oh come on! I insist. No, really. I've got a terrible cough. Good evening, and here is the eight o'clock news. Last night there was a revolution in Mandanga. The rebels attacked the president's palace, shot the president, and burnt the building. The air force bombed the capital. The United States sent ships to the area this morning. The Soviet Union protested in the United Nations. The Scottish police are looking for two climbers in the Highlands. The climbers left yesterday morning to climb Ben Nevis. It began to snow heavily yesterday afternoon. The police sent out a search party yesterday evening. They spent the night on the mountain, but they didn't find the climbers. The Queen opened a new hospital in London today. She met all the doctors and nurses and spoke to the first patients. The Queen wore a yellow dress and a green hat. And next, football. This afternoon at Wembley Stadium, England played against Wales. England lost by four goals to nil. The English captain broke his leg. The Welsh team played well. David Evans scored three goals for Wales. Well, Miss Smith, this is a change. I usually have water with my meals, you know. Yes, Mr. Gibbon, but tonight we're having champagne. Oh, please don't call me Mr. Gibbon. My friends always call me Horace. All right. Horace, and we're having fillet steak. Isn't it wonderful? I normally have egg and chips on Mondays. You see, my wife doesn't like restaurants. Oh, your wife? What's she doing now? Um,、uh, she's watching television at home. What perfume are you wearing, Miss Smith? Please call me Dorothy. I'm wearing Night of Passion. It's lovely. My wife never wears perfume. I don't always wear it, but this is a special occasion. Of course it is. I never come to restaurants like this. Dorothy, I want to ask you something. Oh, Horace, go on. I'm enjoying this evening so much. Well, it's difficult to. Please ask me. Well, you know we've got a lot of work at the office. Yes. Well, can you work on Saturdays until we? Finish it. Oh. Two cars were going along Cambridge Street. An Englishman was driving a Rolls Royce, and a foreign student was driving a VW. The Englishman was driving slowly and carefully. The student wasn't driving carefully. He was looking at a girl. She was walking along the street. She was wearing a short skirt, and she was carrying a handbag. The traffic lights were green. A dog was sitting beside the traffic lights. A cat was sitting on the opposite corner.